Hello everyone, here is Murad from Alphatech.com and in this video, actually my name is Mahmoud, not Murad, so, uh, but my nickname is Murad. And in this video, I'll be showing you how to show, how to remove or remove the toolbar or the action bar in your Android application. So let's say it's annoying you or you don't need it in your Android application, you don't like it or it's taking a lot of space, so you just you need to remove it. You don't need to use it. I don't know why, but I will teach you how to do that. Before we start, before we start, please, guys, be sure to check out my YouTube channel. I really need some subscribers to reach the 1,000 subscriber. Now I need to reach the 800. Then I'll be um, step by step reaching the 1,000 subscriber. Now I really, uh, I really need some subscribers. There's many good videos that I'm glad that they are really getting views and I love you guys now let's uh, check out also my moradfortech.com my website and there's some uh, attractive things so I think I've exceeded my introduction time so let's go okay so we will be hiding the toolbar now there's two conditions if we are using an action bar or if we are, if we are using a toolbar so so the action bar is the normal action bar we all know but the toolbar is a generalization of action bars for use within application layouts it's more flexible and easier to use than the action bar so I recommend using it and this is a sample of it where you can change its color, uh, the app name, color, style, everything you can add any buttons you need and it's more flexible as I said. Now if you need to know more you can check out my website, the link will be below in the description. So as I said if you are using an action bar or a toolbar, so if you are using an action bar also there is two sub conditions let's say. If you are using app compact activity or if you are not using the app compact so if you if you are using the app compact activity what you need is get support action bar dot hide so this will hide the action bar we are using get support because we are using app compact activity not any normal one if you want to show it again, for example, you you are hiding it on some actions or some place, and you want to show it again, so we will be using get support action bar dot show. This is it. Now, if you are not using app compact activity, let's say action bar activity, then the recommended method is to use get action bar, no support action bar, but get action bar directly. Get action bar dot hide the same thing and get action bar dot show as I said if you are hiding it and showing it uh, as well. Okay. Now if you're using a toolbar, not action bar, a toolbar. Let's read this. Sorry guys I can't try this because the emulator is not working right now. I will be trying to try this on a physical device but a toolbar don't worry. Now if you are using a toolbar, then you will be adding here, not after onCreate, but here, between the onCreate and the set content view, you will be a request, window feature, window, dot, no, feature underscore, no title. If you don't need to type this again, you can copy and paste them, but I have studied them because this is the third time I record this video. <laughs> okay, so here we go guys, here we ended. I showed you how to do how to hide the action bar and show it in the case of the action bar and in the case of the toolbar. So here is everything. Please guys don't forget to hit the thumbs up thumbs up and comment below thanks only only thanks five letters thank you yes and this will be very very appreciated for me 
and watch the video to understand the blah though thanks for visiting my website don't forget to hit the subscribe button like and comment and everything guys check out my videos my posts and my videos are amazing with some reviews and getting i went to 1000 subscribers thanks for watching guys please be sure to hit the subscribe button like comment below and cheers let's go my was with you bye bye